the founder and president of Fairytale Endings, Inc. And basically what we do is help struggling families in our community of Sarasota and Manatee County um, provide care and keep their pets so that they don't have to surrender them to shelters or euthanize them. It's been about three and a half years and I was actually working at a local humane society at the time. I was the animal care manager and receiving manager so at that time that was during the kind of big part of the recession and we were seeing a ton of people coming in to surrender and they were crying and just really not wanting to surrender their pets. So they kept reaching out and unfortunately I, I, you know, there wasn't a lot I could do in my capacity there. So I just started the process of founding the 501c3. Well, we have a number of partnerships with um, different veterinarians in our community. Um, we also work with an ER veterinarian. So we get, we get applicants from a number of different routes. We get them directly referrals from the shelters. Um, a lot of shelters know that we exist and when they get clients that are, are looking for other avenues then surrender they often refer them to us so we get inquiries from them directly from our website um, we also get um, applicants from veterinarians that we work with that they get clients that have an issue that's treatable and they know that they the owner can't afford the care so um, we work with them they work with us at a discount a lot so that we can um, you know make a difference it was just a dire straits uh, time for me in my life incredibly uh, uh, out of income and uh, struggling and uh, I had my my dog is my is my uh, my baby um, I was so desperate and he was in such uh, bad shape physically that uh, I, I went to the internet and started to uh, just leave comments on Craigslist for example uh, how you know thinking I could figure out what's wrong with him and how I might be able to cure it with the things I have in my house type of things, you know, home remedies. And uh, I got a response from Reese, which is through Fairy Tale Endings, and she suggested uh, contacting her uh, through, through her organization. And um, I qualified basically because I'm uh, disabled and low income and was able to get the care that Otto needed. Uh, to get him right back up to where he's uh, better than he was before. He, uh, he's amazing to me in how he uh, uh, is centered in my life. Me being diabetic, um, it's amazing. I, I, words cannot describe what he does for me as a diabetic. He, he will um, bark very loudly, waking me up. And uh, oddly enough, every time he barks and I go test my blood at 3 o'clock in the morning, my blood sugar's low. And I would only just sleep right through that. And then I get to a point where I'm so low that I'm sweating and I'm doing, you know, I'm kind of going into in and out of consciousness and things of that nature where um, the ambulance usually comes, you know, because somebody in my house finds me unconscious and has to call the, the, the 911. So it, it never has happened since I've had auto.